Notable A-list Hollywood actors Matt Damon and Ben Affleck are teaming up to create their own film studio. And this comes because they have both slammed Netflix for their assembly line production. And they're taking more of a quality over quantity approach. And that's kind of what they've denounced Netflix for. Is they feel like, you know, yes, they've been great at putting out a lot of content. But they don't think that it's been very high quality. So my question for you guys is, A, what are your thoughts on this? But also, what are your kind of thoughts on, you know, seeing notable public figures and celebrities in certain industries kind of emerging to create, let's say, their own studio. You take like Mr. Beast and Logan Paul. What if they came out with their own social media platform? Like, what are your guys' kind of thoughts on like celebrities and like people that have huge influence and impact in an industry like Hollywood and entertainment doing stuff like that? In Los Angeles, California, in yeah. the United States of America, in the world. <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> they, yeah. <laughs> all, I, all I got is thank God because this movie era we're in right now sucks. Yeah, Dude, I, I want a reason to go to the movies. Yeah. You know, the last movie I went to see was Top Gun, and then in that before that, it's been years. I mean, partially because of, you know, the, the virus, but like, right. dude. I want to go there's, to the movies again. There's, there's been some good films this year that not a lot of people know about. Right. They haven't really gone to see them. Yeah. But there hasn't been like this influx of like, you look at 2010. 2010 just had a lineup of bangers. Even, like, even through like 2016. Social Network. Yeah. Like down the line. We're not going to talk about movies. We're here to talk about the tech and all that in, in the industry. But like, you, you get, I, I get what you mean. It's just yeah. like, like, what's going on? And you, there's a lot of directors coming out and saying this too, but... I mean, Affleck, Damon, I mean, they've been industries. They started independent. Powerhouse they duo. started independent. Powerhouse they start, They wrote the, yeah. their script for their first movie and then ended up being the main characters in it. So Yeah, I mean, I, th I, think, it's, I think it's a big play, you know. I, I think it's a key. Like, th that's that's their way to generational wealth so, like, right what there. Are, how they, what are they going to do differently then to make the quality better? Do, you, do they say? Or? Yeah, I think, you know, really, again, honing in on, uh, you know, the world, first of all, they're actually in the process of, making the first movie right now it's some movie on the, the brand jordan uh but i think you know didn't look too too deep into it but ultimately just again focusing on kind of like quality and getting like the right teams and stuff like that i think them. the problem with why people are saying netflix's stuff has not been great is because they're in this competitive nature of the streaming era and the way that people are winning in the streaming era is who can put out the best original content right now that's really is what it's coming down to. Cause it's just like you can sign a deal to get like all the DreamWorks movies on your platform or all the, you know, Disney Plus has Pixar and all that stuff. But, you know, when it, which for Disney, all their stuff is all original content, but it's, they have such a backlog. When you look at these new, these platforms like Netflix, they have to make original content. They don't have the IP. They have to make original content from scratch. They're trying to compete with the IP of Disney. They're trying to compete with the IP of like all the all, uh, of all these notable productions that have been around for a hundred years, so I can see why like they would say Netflix sucks because they're just trying to put out as much things as possible to compete. I think like Netflix is going to put out probably their fourth or fifth different you know reality TV show about <laughs> you know you know Love, Love Island, Love Island, Dude, whatever get you know out. Like, Get out, just, man. I've seen about 18 million of those shows. This, uh, like, like, not personally, but, like, I've seen them come out over the past couple of yeah. years. And it's just, it's tiring. Like, let's get let's get some fucking theater back. Yeah, seriously. Absolutely. But I 